Welcome to Latte Teacher. In this video, just in three simple steps, we will learn how to use font awesome icons in our application. So, without wasting time, let's get started. Guys, in the last video, we have seen how to access Flutter material icon using an icon widget. For most of the situations, the basic material icons are not enough and we want additional icons for an application. In such a case, font awesome icons can be a simple solution for your problem. Font awesome icons are supported by the library called font underscore awesome underscore flutter made by the flutter community. This library provides more than 1600 free and additional font for your application. So let's understand the steps for using this font awesome icon. Step number one is visit the website pop.dev and search for the dependency called font underscore awesome underscore flutter. Hit the enter button and you will get the first option where the dependency we are looking for. I have on this option and now this is the page where we are looking for the dependency. And from here, just tap on the option called installing and it will show you the uh, dependency that we have to copy. So let's copy this dependency. Now just open your popspec.yaml file and paste the dependency that we have copied below these copertin icons and save this file. Once we save this file, automatically it will run the command called flutter pub gate so that this dependency will be available in your project. And if uh, this flutter pub gate is not working for you, automatically we can go in a terminal and we can manually type the command called flutter pub gate. Hit the enter button so that we can manually get the dependency. Now the second step is we have to copy this font awesome library file. So let's click on copy. And inside your source file means the file where you are looking to write the code for getting that font awesome we have to paste that particular file which we have copied here now the step number three of course the last step is to use this font awesome in your application for this i'm using a center widget and as a child of the center i will use a widget called fa icons so here fa icons indicates we're going to use the font awesome icons in application so uh, inside these uh, fa icons we have a positional parameter which of course requires the uh, icon data. Here by passing the instance of icon data, we can pass the objects in the form of say font awesome icons. Let's try here font awesome icons dot. So uh, whenever we use this font awesome class, this class has got uh, several constant that represents the uh, font awesome icons. Let's use uh, Facebook from here. Let's write here Facebook. So let's save here. We can see we'll get this uh, Facebook icon here. We can of course change the size of this one. For changing the size, we can use the size property. Let's use your hundred, and we can even pass color for that one. Let's say colors. So let's use the blue color. You know? So let's we can write here blue. So save here. It's quite nice. And instead of this Facebook, we can change the Facebook app that use you only the Facebook app symbol. And we can even get the Facebook Messenger. So let's use the Facebook Messenger, and that's gonna work here. So in the same way, we can use whatever icon, means whatever font icon that you want to use. So instead of using this FA icon, we can also use the icon here and that's going to work also. So let me save here, you can see it's working here. Let me change say to say Apple here. We can use your Apple or Apple Store. Let's use your Apple icon. Uh, yeah, that's working. But uh, in most of the cases, instead of using this icon, it is recommended that you should use the widget called FA icon so that we can understand we are using the font awesome icon and not the basic icons of Flutter. And last but not the least point, these font awesome icons are not the interactive icons. So we cannot have any uh, single tab or long tab on that specific icons. In order to make it uh, interactive, we have to use uh, either the icon button. Of course, font awesome works with icon button or we can wrap it inside the inkwell or we can wrap it inside the digital detector as per the requirement. That's it for this video. If you really found this video helpful and knowledgeable, then don't forget to like share subscribe and hit the bell notification button to get my latest videos